Pokemon, gotta catch them all. What's going on guys, it's Power Chi and today I'm gonna be spending the day traveling around town catching Pokemon because I'm sure you guys have heard of it before, Pokemon Go, the new app. Um, so yeah, after I catch all the Pokemon inside this house, I'm gonna go outside and catch more. But first, I gotta put on my Pokemon trainer hat. Okay, wait, that's wrong. Pokemon Go! My Pokemon trainer hat. Let's go catch some Pokemon. Alright, first Pokemon, right here, a Weedle, it's hard to do it with just one hand, so, gotti, gotti, <laughs> holy crap guys, the weather is beautiful, it is 34 degrees, a little bit too hot for my liking, but check it out, it's nice and sunny for catching Pokemon. Alright y'all, um, so we're actually going to be driving about 45 minutes away from where we actually live. Um, it's 48 kilometers away, I don't know if you guys could see that. Oh, just turned off, but yeah, we're going to be stopping um, midway whenever we see Pokemon appear and stuff, and we're going to get out of the car and um, try to catch these Pokemon. You know you're going all out for Pokemon Go when all you see are cows, crops, and driving on side roads. So like I'm from the city or like the suburbs or not and uh, it's really rare for me to see fields of cows and horses and stuff and this app, Pokemon Go, has allowed me to explore the rest of Ontario. This is pretty awesome. Like, look how beautiful everything is. This is the type of stuff you'll never really get to see in the city. Alright, so I'm currently stuck at a side road. Um, trying to catch a Pokemon out here and look at this look at all those cows down there isn't that so cool I really get to see this so it's pretty cool for me Got it! <laughs> drove by a street called Brock Road. Coincidence? I think not! Illuminati! Alright y'all, we just arrived at our destination, Port Perry. It's a small town in Ontario. Let's see what Pokemon they have here. Alright, so it seems to be that there is a Pokemon up there, so let's go get him. Alright dudes, I don't know if you know, but if you click the bottom right of your screen, it shows all the Pokemon that's closest to you, and the one that is closest to us is an Abra, guys. Let's go find this motherfucker. Yes. Yes, after walking around for like a couple minutes, we finally found it. Let's capture this. Nice. Got him. Got him! <laughs> Pokemon, gotta catch them all. All right, let's explore a new area, guys. Maybe if I try sneaking up on these Pokemon, they will show up faster. Or 
Or this is not a gym, but this is a. Uh, is this a gym? We just could consider. No, it's not a gym. Got some more pokeballs. <laughs> ah, I was right. Behind one of those trees is this Paris right here, and we're gonna go try to hunt that thing. And we found the Paris. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so we caught all the Pokemon in this area, so we're gonna hop into the car again and try to find more Pokemon in the area. I just found a Nidoran in the car. Let's catch this. Damn it. I keep missing. Damn it. Can't catch it. Let's catch it. Got he. Got he. <laughs> guys, check this out. You guys should like drive around town and catch all these Pokemon because like you drive by it and you just click it and it stays in the car, which is pretty sick. Alright guys, we made it back home, um, decided to head home because the uh, sun was going down and we didn't want to go Pokemon hunting when it was dark outside, but here are the Pokemon that we got today. So nothing really special other than the uh, Abra, but uh, yeah, we were trying to hunt for a coughing that we saw, but we lost track of it. But, yep, that is the end of this video, guys. If you liked it, please give it a big thumbs up. If you want to see another part two of this, make sure you hit that subscribe button. And I'll see you guys next time.